hello in this seventh video let us see the xp addressing modes at commands and uh, transparent mode of operation in the previous video we saw a transparent mode of communication without doing any parameter configuration in this video let us uh, see the xp addressing modes let us first on the uh, click on the first xp radio and we let us use the dh and dl destination address dh is 8 bytes and dl also 8 bytes let us use the uh, uh, source address of the second radio that is the second radio has got a uh, address that is the uh, serial number let us copy this address and use it as the destination address in the first video uh, first xp radio let us copy and paste the uh, dh as well as dl while pasting the dh do not for forget to add the leading zeros as the leading zeros will not be displayed in the parameter window now click on write now you can uh, have the communication that is typing in the second radio will appear on the first radio as well as from the first radio to second radio this is a transparent mode of communication in the second radio we have not changed the dl and dh it is still in the zero so this will communicate with any other radio but that the first radio we have changed the dh and dl to the uh, that is the source serial number of the first radio now let us use the my address this is specific to s1 that is 802.152.4 this is only in this radio we can assign the my that is the short 16 bit address let us send the first radio my address to 1234 and the second radio my address to 5678 after changing you can uh, just uh, write the configuration or you can use the uh, single uh, write configuration at the right uh, side of the each parameter at the first radio also let us delete the dh and uh, dl and uh, uh, dl of first radio to be the my address of the second radio that is 5678 is the dl of the first radio my address is 1234 and in the second radio my address is 5678 and dl is 1234 that is crossover uh, that is my is uh, for first should be the dl of second and my of second should be dl of first now click on uh, console connect in this uh, both the xp radios now we can see the communication possible from first and second both way communication are possible this is uh, communication using my address 16 bit my address this is possible only in s1 radios and not in s2 we will see the at commands used in xp radios instead of uh, uh, setting inside the XCT window, we can also use AT commands. Let us close the second XCT window. Instead of this XCT window, we can use a terminal software like Putty or Cooltom. In this video, we will be using Cooltom terminal software. Go to the download link and then install the Cooltom uh, terminal software. Mine is Windows uh, machine, so I am downloading the Cooltom for Windows open the cool term terminal software and click on options and then click serial port under this select the com port of the second uh, xp radio which is com 9 for me and then the settings 9600 baud 810 and under uh, terminal settings select the raw mode and then carriage return plus line feed cr plus lf and then put a tick mark against local echo on now click on connect now the terminal is connected to com9 and uh, from the first radio if you click the serial terminal console enable and then type from uh, first radio it will appear in the second radio and if you type inside the cool term it will appear in the first radio that is uh, transparent communication is possible between the two xp radios using cool term terminal software now let us check the at commands from within the cool term before that we can uh, set the uh, options to options and under fonts you can ch change the font settings so that uh, the commands are visible clearly to enter the command mode type in three plus symbols consecutively 
and after a silence it will automatically enter at command mode do not press enter just type in three plus symbols and then wait it will automatically enter command mode now you can type in the at commands at plus ch will return the operating channel as c at plus dh which is the low byte is zero and at plus dl destination at a slow is uh, one two three four this is all already we have done the settings it is just uh, reading the uh, parameters at plus atsh will return the serial number high byte atsl will return the serial low and atbd will return the three which is uh, which represents 9600 baud rate atre will give a default reset that is it will go to factory reset and finally you have to give atwr to write the configurations to the memory otherwise it will not take into effect atcn will come out of the uh, command mode even if you do not type anything for 10 seconds it will automatically come out of command mode again you have to uh, give eight, uh, pl three plus symbols and then wait to enter the command mode from command mode you can also do the settings suppose you want to change the my address at my and then 5678 will change the address at dl and 1234 will change the destination address and finally do not forget to issue at wr command to write the configurations now once the configuration is uh, written you can just communicate same way in xct also you can uh, feed in three consecutive plus symbols to enter the at command mode this is the way to enter command mode at command mode